The chapter of linear inequalities, let's take a look at checkpoint 2.3 part A. Okay, a fruit store owner sells pear at 70 cents each and apples at 40 cents each. He sold all X pears and 9 more apples than pears in one day. So what's the total amount that he received? Let's break this apart. Ah. So I want to have pears. Okay, how many did I sell? I sell X. Each is 70 cents. Okay, apples. I sold what? I sold more. So add 9 more than pears multiplied by 40 cents. So what would my total amount be? Total would be 0.7x plus 0.4x plus 3.6. So combine them together, your total okay, amount received should be 1.1x plus 3.6. Okay, now part B, if he did not receive more than 58, write an inequality to solve for x. So he did not receive, uh, did not means he received lesser than 58, right? So you have 1.1x plus 36 smaller than 58, which means 1.1, okay, you get 22, 1.1x, you get 22x equals you divide over. This time around, you don't have to change sign because there is no negative, okay? So therefore, x is smaller than 20. Now, what would the closest x be? Okay, so this will be your inequality in x, and then to solve for x, which is to equate x. Alright, that part C. Find the maximum number of pairs that he sold. So can x, x cannot be 20 because it's smaller than 20. So what is the maximum number? The maximum number of pairs you are looking at should be 19. Okay?